And welcome back. You are watching News Channel 3 Live at night. In case you didn't know it, it's Make Someone Smile Week. And if you've been watching Live at Nine uh, for a while, now you know our next guest always makes us very happy with her recipes. She always makes us smile. That's right. Chef L Green is with Simple Conception. She's here to share a delicious blueberry sauce. And blueberries, of course, if you don't know, are in season right now. This sauce can be used in many different ways, and you can get you can support local farmers, you can get these very inexpensively, and they're full of antioxidants. They're full of antioxidants. Actually, that's a good point because the U.S. Department of Agriculture for Human Nutrition said that it's the highest ranking vegetable or fruit you can get with antioxidants. So it's oh. something great for a beginning runner. A beginning runner. Great yes. For. So she yeah. can have this and have all of her supplements in oh, one are thing. are you serious? Yeah. He's going to be so on my back <laughs> for the next 10 weeks. I think Because Chef L is also a runner. I know. Yeah. That's I know. It. You're both perfect and I'm a schlep, okay? No. No. <laughs> no. 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 At least we won't say that weeks, today. I'm going to be a new woman. You'll be a new really? woman. Really? You'll breathe yeah, better. You'll clear better. You'll think better. It'll be perfect. Oh, All because of the blueberries. <laughs> because of the blueberries are running. <laughs> okay. The fresh air will do it. Okay. So, so what are we going to be doing? Well, this we have morning? two different recipes that we're going to show to make a crostata. Crostata. A, what? a crostata. Well, in Italy, they have the crostata. In France, they have the gillette. And in America, we have the tart, then turned to a rustic tart. Oh, okay. okay. So it's a crostata. Crostata right. sounds crostata. fancier than tart. And it's much easier to do. I love it. Same ingredients, but much easier to do. So we're going to get started. What we have here is one cup of, don't let that slip away, one cup of blueberries and one fourth cup water that we've already pureed. Okay. okay. Very simple recipe to get going. We have one half cup of agave nectar. Ah, your nectar. Yes, and this is still the brand that's suitable for diabetics. So we're going to add part of that. And then here we have half a tablespoon of cornstarch that we're going to mix into this to make sure it's smooth and we don't want the lumps. Okay. Because this sauce is less than seven minutes to, you know, to get wow. it cooked down. Now, what does the cornstarch do The cornstarch is going to help thicken it even more. The blueberries are high in pectin, which lowers cholesterol. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah, lowers cholesterol. Well, it's like a superfood. It's only in season. It's a superfood. So, get, so it uh -huh. get it now, freeze it, and use it up during the winter time. See, it's already coming to a simmer, so we're going to add the rest of our nectar and the cornstarch. Okay. Stir it because you don't, you want to make sure that it doesn't scorch the bottom of your pan. Okay. Now will this uh, chef still be very sweet or what, what's it the taste have, It's like? sweet. Now, all it is is enhancing the blueberries. Okay. You're going to get a power pack of blueberries in your mouth. Okay. I like to say fairies dancing on the tip of your tongues. Ooh, Ooh. wow. Now yeah. there's an image. So, <laughs> yes, wow. it is. <laughs> That is on a low simmer. We're going to turn it down okay. because it's simmering. Okay. No, you did not break the food processor. We're going to food processor. <laughs> oh, you brought this back? We it's, brought it back. Oh, no. You and it's did. down here next to me. <laughs> uh oh, it's don't waiting judge. for you. Yes, it's thanks a lot, Elle. I back. thought you cared about me. I did you care it about back? It didn't like if me the last missed time. you missed Elle last time, <laughs> Alex broke her very expensive food processor. I got and emails all, from all uh, over the country did saying, not why did break you it. let that man break <laughs> the food processor? So, in here yes. is one and one half cup of plain flour. Okay. One half teaspoon salt, four tablespoons sugar. Now that looks like an interesting sugar. Is that a natural sugar? Organic sugar. Organic. We're sticking organic. everything is organic here. Okay. And first, we're going to pulsate it because we want all of the dry ingredients to come together. Don't touch it, Alex. <laughs> touch it, Alex. Oh, come on. Don't, touch don't, it. don't do it. Don't. Oh, look at that. See, look, look at that. that. I got what the touch. Relief. And from there, while you got it to buy going. Another food processor now. Okay, so We're going to add in. butter, cold butter, okay. four, no, six tablespoons of cold butter. Why cold butter? Because the cold butter is not going to have your dough um, soft. Mm -hmm. You want a dough that you, that's pliable, okay. not a dough that's going to stick around everywhere. And a lot okay. of folks might want to try to do the low fat or the no fat, God forbid, but it's really healthier to just go ahead and use real and butter. And use the right? real butter, yeah. <clears throat> now, it's, if you look, it's kind of like coarse cornmeal. Mm -hmm. That's the texture you want. Okay. So we're going to add the lid again. Give it a whirl, Alex. Oh, oh, and we're going to gradually Ellen, add water. Dangerously, dangerously, honey. Four to six tablespoons. And if you're using a food processor, you hear your sound changing. That's because your dough is coming together. So I'm not breaking it. You're not breaking <laughs> it. Are you no. sure? I'm sure. Okay. So if you stop it, we'll check our dough. 
I think I heard it scream, relief. And this is what you want. You want your dough to be able to stick together. Okay. okay. So at the end, once you've gotten that done, you'll... But it's still a little crumbly, is that it's the right? It's still a little crumbly, okay. yeah. And that's okay because you're going to pat it together, okay. form it into a ball, flatten it into a disc, okay. refrigerate it for at least two hours. Okay. If you're not ready to make it at that point, seal it up perfectly so there's no air. Like in or, saran wrap? In saran wrap okay. or vacuum seal it. Stick it in your freezer for 30 days. And then when you're ready, let it thaw out in the refrigerator, lightly floured board, roll it out. You got your crostata dough right here. Look at that. I love it. So you can make this in advance. You can make it up in advance. And you can make it up in advance in all these steps with your blueberries and still freeze it. Wow. So when you're ready, you have a surprise company to come over. You can pop it out and stick it in the oven and cook it. So you're just going to do a simple fold over. And, okay. Can Very you make simple. this also, you've made it beautiful little individual. Those are can tarts. Can you also make a big one? You can. You can make a big one. Now, those are made with tart pans, so if you don't want to take the um, jump out and take a leap and do okay. it like a rustic, you can buy the tart pans, and this dough will work even with the tart pans. Okay. All right. Chef, we've got about a minute left here. Fill it. Okay. Add your blueberries. Bake it in the oven, 375 degrees, preheat first, 15 or 20 minutes, and you have a delicious dessert. Wow. Here we have the blueberry tarts, raspberry, blackberry, a blueberry, well, a berry combination, and then we have the blueberry bomb. The blueberry bomb? Blueberry bomb. What Grab is this one and on taste top? it. Blueberry mousse, oh. sweet ricotta. That's for you. And oh. then that's the blueberry sauce that we use. And mint, I bet, right? And yeah. mint. Girl. Oh, it's so delicious. Oh, my and gosh. And cute, too. And see, now I can afford to eat this because I'm going to run tonight, Alex. You can. All right. Recipe will be on the website. Mm. Just visit us at WREG.com. Mm. Go to the Live at 9 Very section. Delicious. Oh, my goodness. This is just the mm. stuff. With, oh, oh, my gosh. Mm. Okay, I'm sorry. We may not be able to finish the rest of the show. <laughs> We're not going to be able to finish. <laughs> we'll be back. Chef L, you about done your